What's up, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. So today we're about to hop into a video by The Taco. This is 20 things you did not know about Michael Jackson. So without further ado, y'all, let's hop straight into this video. Michael Jackson had a long <coughs> career spanning 45 out of his 50 years. From his up and downs, the world was constantly watching him. If you're new to our channel, don't forget to hit the red subscribe button. Then give this video a big thumbs up. These are 20 things you didn't know about Michael Jackson. Billie Jean. The song Billie Jean from Michael Jackson's Thriller album was written and produced by Jackson himself. Jackson even nailed the vocals in just one take. The song made music and television history when it became one the take? first music video by a black artist to air on MTV in 1981. Spider-Man In the 1990s, Jackson was planning on buying Marvel jointly with Stan Lee, but the deal fell through. Later, Stan what? Lee came out to say that Jackson had planned on producing a Spider-Man film, and he believed Michael wanted to star as Spider-Man. Vitiligo. Michael Jackson is Spider-Man. Oh my God. Years, that would be Jackson's so crazy. He suffered from a skin disorder known as vitiligo. Vitiligo causes skin to lose its melanin and gives it a bleach looking effect. Many people believe that Jackson was bleaching his skin and making up the story. When he died, the autopsy revealed that the late singer did in fact suffer from vitiligo and he may have bleached his skin to cover the discoloration. He was bald. At the time of his death, coroners noted. Fuck it, I'm gonna say it. I'm sorry for pausing the video, but how do you bleach your scalp? That Jackson only had peach fuzz on his head and was wearing a wig when he died. At the age of 25, the singer had a freak accident where his head caught fire while recording a Pepsi commercial. He was left with second degree burns and bald spots all over his head. Escape plans. Because of the nature of the accusations Michael faced while on trial in 2005, if convicted, he would have ended up in solitary confinement for the duration of his sentence. Unknowingly to Michael, his brother, Jermaine, arranged for a private jet to take Michael to Bahrain if he were convicted. Bahrain has no extradition treaty with the U.S. His children's godfather, Jackson had many strange relationships with famous people in the 80s and 90s. None confused people more than the one he shared with the child star, Macaulay Culkin. The friendship was so deep that Culkin is actually the godfather to two out of three of Michael's children. Most expensive music video. It's no surprise that Michael Jackson would have the most expensive music video of all time. He was an elaborate showman, and the video for Scream starring him and his sister proved just that. The video was budgeted to be a $7 million video, but he ended up dishing out over $10 million when it was completed. He was royalty. Everyone knows Michael Jackson is the king of pop, but did you know he was actually royalty? In 1992, while in the Ivory Coast in Africa, Jackson was crowned king of Sani by the African Agni tribe. They also held a separate funeral for him when he died in Oh, he looks so handsome Daddy. right there. Michael Jackson is one of the most awarded musicians of all time. In 1984, he broke Grammy records when he became the first solo artist to win eight Grammys in one night. He still holds the record for most Grammys won by one person in one night. First performance. Jackson was a performer from the start. He started singing at the age of four, and by the age of five, he made his first appearance in front of an audience. He then made his television debut singing, It's Your Thing, at the age of 10, as lead singer of the Jackson Five. Martin they Spazzini all look alike, that's that. crazy. Jackson they all teamed look up with some pretty amazing directors for his music videos. What most people don't know is there are two versions of the bad music video. The long version plays more like a short film and was directed by legendary director Martin Scorsese. Mm -hmm. Eating habits. Michael Jackson was known to be a picky eater. He was a vegetarian who didn't really like vegetables. His private chef said he also had a sweet tooth but didn't eat sugar and disliked chocolate. Jackson was a fan of Mexican food and also liked grilled tofu served on skewers with couscous and Moroccan sauce. Muscles, the boa constrictor. Many people remember Jackson's beloved pet bubble. Oh, that picture is so there cute. There's a lesser known pet. Michael oh. had a loving pet boa constrictor named Muscles. Muscles was known to accompany Jackson to the recording studio and once caused a frenzy when he escaped his cage. The black armband. In 1988, Michael started wearing a black armband on his right arm. He was inspired to wear it by 1960s war protesters who also wore black armbands. He stated that as long as there are underprivileged children in the world, he would continue to wear the armband. 
Michael Jackson Stamps. <laughs> in 1986, the release of Michael Jackson Stamps was halted in the British Virgin Islands. Certain regulations stated that stamps must depict a living person from the royal family, not the Jackson family. The stamps were eventually released in the Caribbean island of St. Vincent. His patent. That is a cool collector's item. Inventors were granted a U.S. patent for anti-gravity shoes. The shoes were used in shows to make it look like Michael was defying gravity by leaning forward 45 degrees. The patent design had to be redesigned in 1996 when a faulty shoe sent Michael tumbling during a show in Moscow. His first Christmas. His mother raised Michael as a Jehovah's Witness until he disassociated himself with the religion in 1987. In 1993, Jackson was able to celebrate his first Christmas as a surprise for him set up by his dear wow. friend Elizabeth Taylor at his Neverland Ranch. Man in the Mirror The only song from the Bad Album not written by Jackson was the inspirational song Man in the Mirror. If you want to make the world a better place, then you have to do something yourself is the message of the song. Because he believed in the message, Jackson donated 100% of the profits from Man in the Mirror to charity. Highest Earning Deceased Artist Michael Jackson has trumped the likes of Elvis Presley and John Lennon as the highest earning deceased artist. In the first year after his death, his estate made $1 billion alone. He also has the largest recording contract ever, which his family signed with Sony Records for $250 million nine months after his death. His comeback tour. At the time of his death, Jackson was planning the comeback of the century. He was working day and night. Oh, that was a hologram. Hologram. Whatever you call it. Hologram. $1.5 million a night. He had 50 shows scheduled in London alone. Sadly, the world will never get to witness Jackson's comeback as he passed away from heart failure in 2009. 2009. I can't believe it's been that long already. No, what I was saying earlier about like, how can you bleach your scalp or whatever? Um, Basically what I meant was like, you can kind of tell by looking at a black, a dark skinned person or a person who was dark skinned. You can, you can look at them and once they bleach their skin, you can tell that they bleached their skin because it looks kind of, I don't know how to describe it, but it, it, it it's obvious. There is um, there is some inconsistencies, like basically it doesn't look even is what I'm trying to say, especially around the eyes, around the mouth, um, in the hairline area, on the outside area or like the edges of the face or whatever. You can kind of tell around the ears, you can kind of tell when someone has bleached their skin looking at him you don't see none of that it's all one shade like literally it's like almost like white it's just one white shade he doesn't have that patchy look to him that most people get when they bleach i don't see that so i don't get why people would think that he bleached his skin but i guess all right y'all we need, we need, we need some type of controversy on somebody. You know what I'm saying? Like this person cannot be perfect. They must be bleaching their skin. They have to be doing something. They must be doing something because like you, you need something to talk about, but I guess, but yeah, y'all, that was my reaction to this video. If you guys enjoyed my reaction, please make sure to leave a like, comment and subscribe, and I will see you in my next reaction video. Bye.